This is a weekend sound jersey, and we're going to begin our weekend on Friday night, much like we began our week on Monday night with comfortable and crisp air. Now, as we go into the weekend, Saturday will be the best day. We'll see some sunshine, and temperatures are going to be warm well into the 70s. Now, that doesn't mean that Sunday is going to be a bad day. It'll just be cloudy, and then rain will eventually start between 4 to 7 p.m. from the remnants of Delta. And then the remnants of Delta, along with a cold front, are going to be rain right through Tuesday and coastal flooding will be likely at this time. For tonight, we'll see temperatures drop from the 60s into the 50s on the mainland at the shore. We'll so slide through the 60s here. We'll have that blanket of high clouds keep some of that heat in. That's why we won't be as chilly as where we were this morning. And for Saturday, mid to upper 70s, pretty good short stay here in South Jersey. Any kind of outdoor activities are looking great. If you're doing some fall foliage, here is our map from the New Jersey Forest Service. Some change for much of the state. Last week, Cumberland and Cape May counties were under no change. Now we're seeing some change everywhere here in South Jersey. If you do want to go well north, they are at the midpoint. You get some good yellows and oranges and reds and all that good stuff up there. Then for Sunday again, cloudy day, mostly dry though, and we're going to be on the warmer side. Temperatures about five degrees above average. Let's say look at our future radar here. This is Sunday at 8 p.m. We get some showers to come in and then what's going to happen is as we go into Sunday night and into Monday, the rain will intensify and become heavier. Then you're going to notice more of this green. Where's that coming from? That's a cold front that eventually passes through, but before it does so, it's going to be more rain Monday night into Tuesday. Probably won't be dry until early on Wednesday. And as a result, we're expecting anywhere between an inch and a half to two and a half inches of rain. Hamilton's at 2.2, Atlantic City at 2.1, Seattle's at two on the dot here. So a lot of rain, but it's coming over a long period of time. So I'm not anticipating many flooding issues, at least on the roadway side. Coastal flooding is a different story. We are anticipating two rounds of coastal flooding during the Monday p.m. and the Tuesday a.m. high tides. Here's a look at your mainland seven day forecast. Let's take you into next week. We do have 72 degrees for our Tuesday. We're going to have rain fall. And as we go into Wednesday and Thursday, mild here. And we've been saying for a couple of weeks here, especially if you read the full foliage forecast, that the second half of October looks to be mild. And it's exactly what we're going to be as we get into Wednesday and Thursday. We're going to be at the midpoint of October come Thursday. Have a great weekend, everybody. We'll be back with you Monday morning with the latest in South Jersey weather videos. However, the weather doesn't stop on social media. You can always come back to our website right here at thepressofac.com slash weather.